Hey everyone, Morten Nostad here. Welcome to my channel and welcome to another unboxing. A few weeks ago I got a shipment of some CDs from Amazon that I'm really excited about. Uh, but before I show you those, if you please click like and not least subscribe, that will help my channel move along and it makes me happy. So here it is from Amazon Germany. Uh, this one arrived quite quickly, unlike the Rolling Stone stuff that I'm still waiting for. Um, but I haven't shown it to you yet because they arrived while my older brother was staying here and I didn't really... Uh, I, this is not a huge apartment or anything, but so we were, we were staying fairly close to each other and, you know, talking and hanging out and he's was helping me with a few things around the house so i just didn't get around to uh, recording a video uh he left a week ago and then today i remember oh hey i'm supposed to listen to these records so the the cds that i got are um, these by Sax saxon uh sorry about the glare um i love saxon i uh, have for many many years i used to have their first seven albums on vinyl um since back in the day uh 80s uh they're all gone i don't know what happened to them um <laughs> uh so i but uh, anyway for many years now i've been buying saxon again on cd and but that period of um mid to not late 90s and the early 2000s they've been no, sort of all out of print and you find some of them in the wild and they look like they don't look good, uh, so I, um, uh, I've, I've been, I've been slowly getting them. Uh, but uh, these reprints look uh, promising, and there are three or four or five more to to come out. And I think uh, I'm, I'm on a good path to finally completing my Saxon collection. So let's see, what is the oldest one of these? I think it's um, Dogs of War. So let's dig into this. These are German, and um, I suppose they're from a period where, well, Saxon were never huge, but um, these are from a period of time where they were really not doing very well as far as sales and popularity goes. Uh, cool cover reminds me of uh, well, reminds me a bit of Motorhead's not last but the one before that album. Yeah, now Saxon have always been great. I think. Well, I think they should have been called the Britons or the no, I just kidding, the Welsh. Uh, then we have the band at the time. So some other artwork or pictures in here? Nope. So there was Dogs of War from 1999, I think. Yeah. That's the track listing. Next one. Saxon Unleash the Beast. Another cool cover. Minus the glare. And there's the tracks. In 1997. <laughs> there we are. This was Doug Scarrett's first CD. He co wrote songs on it, and it was the start of the Quinn Scarrett Partnership. Let's see. Let's 
love their I love their logo. I remember I had a I wonder if it's still lying around somewhere. I had a battle vest. You know that quintessential piece of heavy metal uniform you need when you go to concerts. Mine were uh, was olive, olive green. It was um, so it was not denim, and I used to wear it out to sign my black leather jacket. And uh, I had a I think it was this big at the neck, base of the neck. I think it was that said Saxon in on royal blue with silver. Oh, it's very nice. <laughs> What was my main uh, back? I think it was uh, our maiden, Aces, Ace of Spades. Ace of High, sorry. And there we go. Should we look at the CD? Nice, oh, just black and yellow there. Last one. Metal Head. This one is the one from 1999. Black on orange, it's not very easy to read. Um, this was 1995, I think, yeah. So, Metalhead. I think this is probably the, the coolest cover. <clears throat> Never seen Saxon. Um, I, uh, I had tickets to see... Uh, Oh, who was that? I think I had tickets to see Meg Megadeth in Oslo, and Saxon were the um, um, were, were the support group, and then I got sick. I think it was when I got swine flu. Yeah, so I, I never I never saw them. There's the band. There's the lovely cover. It's sort of a, yeah, I would say sort of an Egyptian look to it. There's the booklet, songs. I don't really think these are really well, well made. It's so nice to have a fresh new. Saxon record in my hands instead of a ratty old overpriced a CD with a jewel case that looks like it's been dragged behind a car. There's the back. Reminds me, I didn't show you the first CD, did I? Not as well. Here we go. So that was a little bit of a walk down hard rock memory lane. I uh, hope you enjoyed seeing those uh, Saxon uh, CDs this time. Uh, please click like and subscribe and I hope to see you again soon in another video. Take care guys, bye.